steady till they're wondering Did he machine gun kept Sick of rappers always claiming that they live hard I spin it back to the future when my ship starts what is up guys this is the axel a principal for editor school um the tutorial i'm going to be teaching you guys today is the effect where the advertising come the advertisement comes up and the video pauses and it looks really realistic and the people watching the video think it's a real ad and stuff so yeah so um first of all i got this like idea from from ly foons i saw this video and i tried to recreate it and what i recreated was pretty good so guys check him out his channel is ly foons and yeah so i give him all the credit for making this i just re recreated it and yeah so what you guys what you guys are gonna want to do is go to the description of this video and um click the download links for the youtube pause button the play button and the mouse plus sound.rar so what you're gonna want to do is um you're gonna be brought to this site right here and it says right here please wait I'm just pause this video so and then please wait and then when it gets to zero just click skip ad and it should automatically bring you to the website and just click download and do the same to all these skip and skip and then you just click download and it should be on your desktop so now let's get into After Effects. Wait, first of all, it's gonna look like a green screen, kind of like that. It's really fast. It's just a play button and pause button, and I made that myself. So I never got that off anyone else. Like that pause button, play button, I made that myself. And yeah, so I got in After Effects I already imported my clip and my thing. And if you don't know how to do that, just go to File, Import, File, Import your shit, and it should be here. Just drag it down into this, and I drag the second one down here. And first of all, you're gonna want to know when the the best like the part of the song is when you want to make a shoot. So you just click on your clip, click LL to show you the sound waves, and it shows over here it's quiet and it goes and it makes a loud sound. So right here, it like let's just see what it sounds like. Oh, I'm just gonna go here, take off the video for a second. You guys don't need to do this. I'm just gonna listen to what it sounds like. Okay, so that's a good part. Sorry if you didn't hear that, but so I'm gonna like put the video back on. And what you're gonna want to do is find a spot where um he's about to shoot. So like he shoots like around here somewhere. If I can find it, um, let me zoom in a little bit. All oh, right, there I saw the flash. Okay, there that's the flash. So what you're gonna want to do is um highlight over um here like where the shot is and then you wanna you wanna like make sure the line is right over the like the part where the bass drops or whatever it is and just make the shot go like that so then so it's like as soon as it comes to shoot so that's basically how you sync it and to add the effect this is what you're gonna do so you gotta go before you wanna add it i'm gonna add it like right here right before he shoots so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um, go to edit split layer so now it makes another frame right so then I'm gonna um, copy this control C control V and it copies so there's two layers of the same thing and then the top one what you want to do is go to layer layer time and freeze frame Wait, no, not time stretch. I'm sorry, guys. Um, freeze frame. So now all it is is just one frame. So once you do that, um, you got to move this back. Like right there. And before you do anything, you got to split the audio too. So you go click on the same spot and go to um, file, I mean edit and split layer. So yeah. And then just move this about just there for now. And what this is going to do is it's going to look like this. And then all of a sudden it stops at, along with the sound and stuff. So, yeah. So th that's what we want. And then now what we're going to do is import our pause. So import your pause on the desktop. Pause button. And then add it on top of your like color correction if you have one so it doesn't get colorized. And when you see this, you add it, and you can see it's like a green thing. So the way to fix that is we just go to the part where it's the maximum, and we click this little pen tool, and we just cut around it. 
Oh, sorry. It has to be a rough mask. It doesn't have to be like a good mask. Just so all the black goes away. And once that is done, you want to um, go to the effects and precepts tab. Over here and search up key light. Key light. And then just drag it on your thing. And then you want to, where it's screen color is, click this little thing and tab on the green. So now what it is, is um, it's just the the pause button so now all we have to do is scale it up so move this back a little bit so it things click on the corner and hold shift and pull out scale it out to what you guys think it will be so like if it were to pause it would be a little more this way oh yeah um and one more thing i forgot to add the the advertisement so there will be another link like same thing as these so what you got to do is just download the advertisement too and yes yeah, so it should be in the description and um yeah one sec let me go back i'm lost for a second so it goes um i want to make it so that advertisement come here like around up here so i go to i gotta import the ad now i also cut that from a video like another one where is it ad right here so what you're gonna do here is um drag it on top of your thing and put it to full res and zoom in. What you're gonna do is the same thing but actually like do this nice like I'm just doing a stay zoom in and take your time and think like do it properly like all the way around. I'm just going fast for the tutorial and there you go. So that's the basic one and then just click here, click M to go to mask. Click the down arrow, wait no, click the down arrow, and then put the feather up to like, one, maybe two, depends what you want. Just change it to your liking guys, and basically now what we do is, put this down, let's find where we want to add it in. So see how it's like small, we want to do the same thing, so zoom in, and then hold the corner, hold shift, see if that happens just click control Z. So zoom in properly so you can actually click on the thing. Right here. Um, oops. This is really weird. Oh my god. Okay, there you go. So scale it how big you want. And just put it where you think it's going to be in the, vid like the real video. So since that's thing, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead a little bit, like where you when you want it to come up, and we're gonna click the.